can't help myself. I'm gonna have to flick a little cicada in that little pocket over there. Millerod's brawler on a dial of surtate. Six pound braid, 10 pound leader. Tiemco soft shell. Oh, mate, this spin casting in the creeks is not for me. Definitely love the accuracy of the bait caster. <laughs> Almost got it snagged two in a row. I'm gonna move upstream just a little bit more. Probably spooked absolutely everything. Every man and their dog in that pool. Cicadas are singing though. Nice and loud, so that should work. Let's get going. Some deep pockets on the other bank. I don't know if I can cast this real tight. I haven't actually properly fished spinner baits, so this will be interesting. Keen to tick off my first, if there's any about. It's a pretty violent action on this thing. Should grab the attention, I just don't know if it's a bit too big. Too much distance. There we go. Hmm, that potentially spooks some stuff. We got it back. Oh, Josh, terrible casting day. Putting on appalling effort right now. Paradise. Hoping I can see a nice pool up here with a bit of deep undercuts. Oh yes. Oh, there's a guaranteed fish in here. Oh, are you kidding? Can you see that back, Eddie? Look at that. Perfect slack zone. Dude, this looks so good. I can't believe I didn't get a bite out of that. I might actually take off this trailer. Looks alright, but at the same time it does look a bit funny. Put it in my back pocket. This is one of those spots that you can chuck lures at all day long, just because it looks good. But because it looks good to us doesn't mean it looks good to the fish, unfortunately. This looks great, but I can't really get a cast unless I'm up here. Make too much noise. Oh. 
Good hit. <laughs> right on the edge. Must have followed it out from that trunk. I actually might see real quick if it'll take a top water. Before I change lure, see if I can switch bait it on a different subsurface. I'll try a cicada. There he is. Oh, oh, he's come off. That little Tiemco tempted the bite from a very small bass. And it's flared up. I'm just going to be able to grab it. Get my finger in your mouth. There we go. First one for the morning. Hole of probably 15 centimetres. Look at this country. Get a quick little close up on the camera, which you're probably seeing right now, and put it back in the drink. Take that. Although we did just get a fish then, I don't know why that first hit I had felt maybe 10 to 15 more centimetres bigger. Could have been that same fish, because they do rock lures very hard. But we'll just see. Cast this around a bit longer. And switch back. Cicada feels like it's not swimming properly. Sorry, looks, not feels. Got a bite though. Oh yeah, another one on it. Just gonna eat that. Let's try the Black Prince one. Black Prince imitation. Oh, that was epic. Rolled it straight over some gnarly structure. <sighs> and I already fished this pool. Not that spot though. This goes to show you've got to get it right in there. Wow, almost looks like a colors of a sooty grunter. That's hectic. I've never seen a bass's belly almost fully black. There we go, bass number two, off the top, once again, top water cicada. That's pretty epic since I've already fished this ground, but like I was saying, just goes to show and pays when you get that cast right at the back. I didn't get it like super deep, deep in structure, but with my glasses I can see um, there's a lot like logs crossing each other, probably about three or four. Cast it over there, gave it a bit of a burn because I didn't want to get fully bricked. And yeah, there's the result. Beautiful, probably 26 to 27, maybe slightly bigger. Aussie bass. Let's get him in. Go on. Oh, look at this log. Mate, there's a fish under that.
So that is something challenging for the caster. More of a challenging. I don't even know what I'm saying. Get your line in the water, bruh. Right at the edge. Instead of chucking that lure, I might put on a chatterbait. I knew there'd be a fish there. Made it down to what I'm going to call the last pool of the day. This terrain up the mountain gets pretty gnarly, and there won't be too many other spots I can pop out from what I'm seeing. So we'll give this deep pool a go and then head back. Hopefully we can get something on this. New combo. All right, I think that's gonna be enough for today. Many hours and Ks put in. Two fish. Quite interesting. Now I've got to somehow get back up here.